Magandang araw mga kapet pals. Ako po si Doc Harold Ray Di Maisip, ang brand manager ng Pet Options. Mga kapet pals, naranasan nyo na ba mag-alaga ng mga large breed dogs? Katulad ng kasama ko ngayon na isang bull, mastiff. What are the things that we need to know about them? Panoorin natin to. The Bull Mastiff is a very powerful breed, full of substance, full of bone. Well, it's a British breed, um, bred in the 19th century. It constitutes of 60% Mastiff to 40% Bulldog. It's, um, it was bred to, to guard, to guard land and, and protect people um, living on estates. They came to the Philippines approximately 20 years ago. So the Bull Mastiff is in the working group. Um, the male's average height between 25 and 27 inches and the weight would be around 50 to 60 kilos. The female's average height will be in a region of 23 to 25 inches with a weight of 40 to 50 kilos. The head is the signature of the breed. The circumference of the skull is approximately the height of the dog to its withers. The reason for the squareness of the head is to protect it from poachers, from attackers, uh, when being attacked, when in confrontation. The eyes have to be, have to be dark in colour. The ears are small, and the reason for that is so that an attacker, a poacher, wouldn't be able to hold on to the ears and uh, use it as, as against them in a, in a confrontation. The bull mastiff has a typically black mask. The reason for that is so that at night time, an intruder or would-be poacher would find it difficult to see the bull mastiff looking at them. So that's very important with a dark set of eyes. So the bull mastiff comes in three colours. Brindle being the, the original colour and perhaps the most famous of all colours because it's dark, it's good at night time. Um, nowadays, you get a lot of fawns and you got a lot of reds. The tail, it has a regular tail which acts as a counterbalance. Um, so when the dog's twisting and turning, if it's in a confrontation with a assailant, it, the, tail, the, the tail helps it move around and twist and turn. So it is very important for the dog. We're very lucky that we have the staff with us. We have um, six uh, boys that takes care of many of the big dogs. And then we have also the females that takes care of the small dogs. But since they're not really that high maintenance, you don't need to groom them very much. They're just, um, you know, just uh, very nice and very sweet dogs. It's very easy to take care of. Okay, tuturo ko naman sa inyo kung paano pag-groom ng bull mastiff. Magsimula tayo sa whiskers niya. Kasi ginugroom natin yan, so ginagamitan natin siya ng razor. Ginugupit natin tong part na to. So kailangan natin siyang gupitin. So gamitin natin 00 para makuha natin yung mga mga whiskers niya. Maging guwapo siya pagdating sa dog show. So ingat lang tayo kasi baka pag lumabas yung dila niya, magupit natin. So dahan-dahan lang. Then sunod naman natin yung pagtitrim ng kuko ng aso. Hindi natin sila kailangan saktan so huwag tayong gumamit masyado ng uh, nail cutter for the bull mastiff. Mas maganda sa kanila is yung grinder para dahan-dahan siyang nawawala. Okay. So, gantong grinder ang gamitin natin. Dahan-dahan siyang dahan-dahan mag-grind yung kuko ng aso like this. Dahan-dahan. Dahil pag sila ay nasaktan, madadala sila. Baka hindi na sila magpagupit ng magpat, magpatrim ng kuko. Ngayon, yung grooming ng bull mastiff, yung nail niya, pakikita natin yung tinatawag na quick, yung laman niya sa loob. Kailangan wag natin yan madadampihan dahil magkakameron ng bleeding. Mahirap maampat ang dugo ng, ng mga aso. Okay. Etong formerator, makita nyo maliliit siya, para siyang suyod. So, ang purpose niya, punin yung undercoat ng aso. Kahit long coat, okay lang din to. Kahit short coat, mas maganda. Kinukuha niya yung mga undercoat at yung mga, mga dead hair, yung mga patay na buhok. So, dahan-dahan nyo lang siyang iyahagod na ganyan hanggang doon sa ilalim niya, ilalim ng coat niya. After ng permurator, uh, gagamitan naman natin siya ng mga pampakintab sa balat. Ito ay ginagawa namin 
bago mag-dog show. One hour before the show. Yan, ganyan lang po yung pag-spray. Buong katawang po, yung coat nila, kailangan malagyan. Then, dito, ang nila. Okay. And after that, ito naman ang gamitin natin para sa finish na pampakintan. Mula, mula ulo, katawan, paa. Ayan. Ayan lang, paulit-ulit lang. The common behavioral traits of a bull mastiff is that they're very high-spirited, very faithful, they're very alert, um, and, and they're very confident dogs. So the bull mastiff is very adaptable. It can, it's good in, the, in a home, it's good in an apartment. The bull mastiff is very playful. Uh, they like to swim, they like to run, they like to play with water, they like to play with people, they like to play with other dogs. The health issues to look out for this breed is typically cancer. They are cancer prone, so that is something to, to, really, to really look out for. Bull mastiffs need to be kept in a, a cool room, cool environment. Um, due to the, the flat nose of the breed, it's difficult for them to, to, to take heat. So you've got to keep them cool, um, ideally in an air conditioned room, but somewhere in shade is also fine. sa breed na bull mastiff is um, not only that they are big and strong and they can protect the family but also they're very gentle they're very sweet sobrang lambe and clean sila <laughs> you always they always need attention and i like giving attention to the dogs so um, i feel very safe walking with them during the night because um, sobrang um, loyal nila and very protective sila. It's a very proud, it's a very noble breed, and you have to give the bull mastiff a lot of respect. Um, it's a very extremely powerful dog, so you have to be very careful of that. You have to be very disciplined with the dog, you have to be very fair with the dog, and you have to care for the dog very well. Ayun mga ka-pet pals, mapamaliit man o malaki, ay kailangan natin silang alagaan. Muli ako po si Doc Harold Ray Dumaisip, ang brand manager ng Pet Options, para sa pets and vets.